G'day. Seek out the root cause, not the solution. G'day. 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 That was a great quote from a guy called Ray Dalio. Now, if you don't know who Ray is, billionaire investor in the US, founder of a company called Bridgewater Capital, and recently, fairly recently, published a book called Principles, which is essentially outlining what he sees as the principles to a happy life. Now, that book has gotten rave reviews from a lot of smart people. So it's always a good indication when you've got a bunch of diverse people saying that actually is a good book, it's probably a good book. And there's a nice little summary of the book of the principles on in a YouTube video, which is a great example of storytelling. Nice little animation, nice little background music. I'll put a link to that in the comments below. But the one thing that really resonated with me and what he said was when you're looking to, when you find a problem, don't go and seek out the solution, seek out the root cause, which makes perfect sense because that's how you're going to stop those problems reoccurring and potentially fix a whole bunch of other stuff that is around that, that, that enabled that cause to become a problem. I think what we always tend to do, of course, is we go straight for the solution, but that's really the short-term fix. If you want to fix something long-term, whether that's emotional, whether it's something about your business, whatever you need to do, whatever problem you need to solve, solving it long-term is about identifying the root cause and then address the root cause. Fixing a problem by finding a solution to a problem is really only half of the answer. I just think it's a great, great perspective on problem solving. Again, link to that little video below, it's 30 minutes, watch it. Don't just listen to it, watch it, because I think it's a great little storytelling example as I mentioned. Alrighty, that is it for today. I do thank you for your time and I will be back again tomorrow. See ya.